Welcome to Bike Tracker, your trusted hub for the latest updates on defence and automotive technology. Today, on the occasion of India's Independence Day, the 15th of August, we bring you a detailed look at the brand new 2025 HL Tejas MK2, a fighter jet that symbolises India's growing aerospace power. Stay tuned till the end, and don't forget to subscribe for more exciting updates. A historic moment. Unveiled during the Independence Day celebrations, the 2025 HL Tejas MK2 has captured the attention of defense experts worldwide. This moment marks not just a technological leap but also a step towards self-reliance in defense production, showcasing India's capability to design, develop, and produce advanced fighter jets. Upgraded design and performance. The Tejas MK2 features a larger airframe, allowing increased fuel capacity and weapons payload. With a powerful GE F414 engine, it offers improved thrust and agility, making it capable of Mach 1.8 speeds and superior combat range. The advanced fly-by-wire system ensures better maneuverability during intense aerial missions. Cutting-edge avionics and weapon systems. Equipped with a state-of-the-art AESA radar, advanced electronic warfare suite, and beyond visual range missile compatibility, the Tejas MK2 stands ready for both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions. The integration of indigenous weapons like Astra missiles further boosts its strategic advantage. Strategic Impact for India With the Tejas MK2 entering service, India will strengthen its air defence capabilities and reduce reliance on foreign imports. This is a proud achievement for the country's aerospace industry, perfectly timed with the spirit of Independence Day celebrations. Conclusion Call to Action The 2025 HL Tejas MK2 is more than just a fighter jet. It's a symbol of progress, innovation, and national pride. As India celebrates another year of freedom, the skies are set to be guarded by this indigenous marvel. If you enjoyed this update, make sure to like, share, and subscribe to Bike Tracker for more defense and tech insights. Jay Hind